Hi, I'm Phil Matier, the test pilot for the Terra Fuji Transition, and I want to tell prospective pilots a little bit about flying this airplane. This is the second one I've done before I talked a little right after the first flight, and now I've had 28 takeoffs and landings in the Terra Fuji Transition. I'm just going to go through a little bit about the plane and about the flight test and what it's like to fly this vehicle. Note this, walk up to a car door, open up a car door, get in and sit in a car seat. How cool is that? If you've climbed in and out of little airplanes for a long time like I have, you realize what a, what a nice feature that is. Come on inside. I'm going to invite you inside the cockpit. Welcome inside the transition. A little discussion on what it's like to operate this vehicle from the inside. You can see the cockpit. We have all the displays of a normal airplane and a normal car. I'd like to emphasize it is a prototype configuration. We have an industrial design team working on the next version, but this one isn't bad. I have my flight control display is primary right in front of me. All the engine instruments visible right there. Navigation, GPS, communications, and transponder all right there. A little bit about the controls. When we're in the, uh, the road mode, I have a steering wheel and a gas pedal and a brake. Those are all the controls of a normal car. Anybody can drive it. When we switch to the airplane mode, my feet go out on two rudder pedals. The stick unfolds from the floor and comes up. Now I have a stick and a throttle and rudder pedals. Those are all the controls of a normal airplane so that any pilot can fly it. And any driver can drive this and any pilot can fly it. 